Five months ago, June 18th, 2023, Evolutions were released into Clash Royale, with the new release of Evolved Barbarians, Skeletons, Firecracker, and Royal Giant. People instantly started using these evolutions to see which one is the best. There was some competition between these three cards, but Evolved Skeletons were the worst by far. But then Supercell decided to buff them. And then they buffed them again. And again. And once more. And now they are one of the best evolutions, if not the best. And that's why I'm giving you 15 tips to dominate with evolved skeletons. Tip number one. You can fully counter a goblin barrel with evolved skeletons by placing them on this tile as soon as you see the goblin barrel. <laughs> Tip number two. Against royal recruits, you always want to play all your skeletons to one side. If you try splitting them, they will just die and do nothing. Tip number three. With just two elixir, you can go ice spirit and evolved skeletons at the bridge, and they will three crown the enemy if they don't have a proper counter. This combo works really well when your opponent is also low on elixir. They need to have a small spell in their hand or they can't defend. Tip number four. You can use evolved skeletons to counter electro giant because the skeletons just keep on spawning. It won't fully counter the electro giant, but the skeletons can do an insane amount of damage for just one elixir. Even if the enemy uses tornado, the skeletons might sometimes survive it. Tip number five. Splitting your evolved skeletons. Splitting your skeletons wasn't a good idea against recruits, but otherwise, it usually is a great idea. Splitting the skeletons always gives you a positive elixir trade, and they might even win you the whole game. I have won hundreds of games by splitting evolved skeletons with royal hogs. I have another video explaining this combo because it truly is an unstoppable combo. Even pro players like Muhammad Light are using this combo. Tip number six, you can fully counter a Mega Knight with Evolved Skeletons. That's a plus six elixir trade. So if you are struggling against Mega Knight, start using Evolved Skeletons. Tip number seven, switch your Skeletons placement when using Evolved Skeletons. If you usually place your Skeletons here, don't do the same with Evolved Skeletons. You can place your Evolved Skeletons to a different place where they still do the same job. This way, you are less predictable to enemy spells. Tip number eight. You can fully counter the little prince with just skeletons. All you need to do is wait for the ability and then place your skeletons on the little prince. This is very helpful because a lot of people are using little prince. Tip number nine. Play aggressively when you know you can defend with evolved skeletons. The enemy will focus on defending your attack, so you can just defend with evolved skeletons. That's another positive elixir trade. Tip number 10. When going for the second tower and you know your enemy has a building, place your skeletons to the pocket and they will most likely connect to the enemy tower. They might even three crown the enemy. Speaking of three crowning, tip number 11. When going for the three crown, place your skeletons here so they will split to three different groups, making it almost impossible to defend. If they don't have tornado or arrows, they will have a really hard time defending the skeletons. Tip number 12. You can almost fully counter Graveyard with just the skeletons. Even if they use a spell like Poison to kill your skeletons, that's a positive elixir trade for you. Tip number 13. Watch out for Mother Witch because it's the only card that can cause massive trouble against evolved skeletons. When facing Mother Witch, you should be very careful with your skeletons or have a spell that can counter the Mother Witch. Help me! Help! Tip number 14. Evolved skeletons can destroy the enemy tank in seconds, even if they have support cards like Electro Dragon behind it. You should use this as your advantage and place your skeletons on the enemy tank as soon as possible. Tip number 15. Evolved skeletons can do everything that normal skeletons can. You shouldn't always try to save your evolved skeletons, trying to get huge value with them. Sometimes you should use them just like normal skeletons, even if they won't get huge value. That's why I suggest you to watch this video here to find out what normal skeletons are capable of.